Today we'll be subtracting and simplifying in the expression 1 over x minus 4 over x squared minus x minus 6. Our first step is to factor our denominators. The first term has a denominator of x, that can't be factored so that's going to stay the same. And then in our second term the factors of negative 6 that make negative 1 are negative 3 and negative 2. So now we want to make a common denominator. The second term needs a factor of x, so we'll multiply by that on the top and bottom. The first term needs a factor of x minus 3 and x plus 2, so we'll multiply by that on the top and bottom. What we get is x minus 3 times x plus 2 over x times x minus 3 times x plus 2. In the second term, 4 times x gives us 4x, and the denominator will be the same as the first term. So now we want to FOIL the binomials in the numerator. This gives us x squared minus x minus 6. We're going to leave the denominators factored. This will make it easier if we can cancel later. So the second term is going to stay the same. Now we can combine our numerators. We have a negative x minus 4x, so now our x term is negative 5x. And our denominator will stay the same. So now we want to factor the numerator to see if anything can cancel. Be careful on this one, the factors of negative 6 that make negative 5 are not negative 3 and negative 2, that wouldn't give us a negative 6, it's actually negative 6 and positive 1. So here, we won't be able to cancel anything. We could leave our answer in this form, where everything is factored, or we can distribute everything. That numerator will give us an x squared minus 5x minus 6. And in the denominator, you can take this in steps, foiling out the binomials first. Um, our final distributed answer is x squared minus 5x minus 6 over x cubed minus x squared minus 6x.